So I've lived in Barbrigan for a while and here are some of the greatest things about living in Barbrigan. Barbrigan is a seaside town which means we live beside the beach and it's only toxic two tours of the year so you know it's nice one tour but even then you can guarantee the junkies have climbed to it making their nests out with syringes and hear the burnt out cars. If you ever move to Balbriggan, you don't have to worry about having nothing to do as we have a variety of activities from hanging around the shopping centre, eating Pringles and smoking brodies to dropping bombs down the back beach at 6 o'clock in the day. If you're ever looking for a takeout, we have 5 star food. The only thing is the place might have previously burnt down with a rat in the fryer. Or if you want a more finer dining experience, you can probably find the van that sells mints and a half bun that goes around the town. The nightlife of Babrigan is simply amazing. Well, if you want to go out to a pub full of gazers and old ones, but other than that, there's the nightclub. But it's not like any other nightclub like you've ever seen, because what they done with this nightclub is, right, get this, they put up beside a harbour, you know, when you're walking home. Hasn't even got a barrier or anything. So, you know, it gives that little bit of edge when you're walking home. But sure, the best part is, you get to see everyone you saw eight hours ago from Tesco in there as well. Fabrigan has a very strong guardy presence. Turning up two hours later and asking do you want some of the leftover daddy burger for comfort as that's all they can do. The community of Valbriggan is something else. If you look on the public page and the Facebook, you can see people complaining about the problems happening to them and hoping everybody else will deal with them and not themselves. And eventually, fuck all gets done. What a shock. Hey, classy as fuck, Valbriggan.